This is our storybook. Keep a flower. Once there was a mischievous butterfly. He flew and flew from garden to garden, from flower to flower. One day, he met a cheerful sunflower. Hello, butterfly. Will you be my friend? Of course, flower girl. I can be your friend. Well, Thank you very much. But you have to promise me one thing. What's that? Will you be my friend forever? Yes, I will. Will you come visit me every day? Every day. Mm. Okay, I will. Since then, the sunflower waited for the butterfly every morning. And the butterfly visited the sunflower. <laughs> See how they play.
One day, the butterfly was feeling lazy to visit the sunflower. He thought, I can meet her any time I want. And then, he went on to visit other flowers. This continued. Once, twice, thrice. But on the fourth day, he turned up. The sunflower was happy to see him. And she said, I'm so happy to see you. I was worried. Where have you been? I went to visit some other friends. But... I missed you, sunflower. I'm sorry. I missed you too, said the sunflower. And they tried to play together again. But... <gasps> Your petal! Are you okay? The sunflower replied, saying, My petals are falling. Can you play with me these last few days? Once my petals fall, I will not be able to see you again. Last few days? Can I do anything for you? Now they feel sad. Yet the sunflower says, I'm afraid not. But come on. Let's play until then. <laughs> so they played and played and enjoyed their last few days. The butterfly was sad that he could only play a little bit more with the sunflower. <laughs> Though he never found another sunflower, she was always and forever in his heart. The end. Stories are for sharing. Stories are for bonding. It is not to judge or to discriminate, but to empathize and evolve. This story is not just for children, but also for the child in you.